All right, guys, welcome back to the channel. I want to show you a new power supply to charge my DIY portable power boxes when there is no solar available. I'll demo my DC power box, which uses a 7S 7P battery. At nominal voltage of 25.9 volts, this box provides 453 watt hours of power. Previously for charging, I was using a smaller 12 volt 3 amp 36 watt adapter to charge around one amp of power for the 7S battery pack. One amp at 27 volts equals 27 watts of power. Charging at 1.3 amps comes close to the 36 watt limit of this power supply. This also draws 47 watts of AC power at 120 volts. Charging with more power requires a larger power supply. The number one benefit of more power means faster charging times. Here is a discarded HP 90 watt output power supply that was headed to e-waste for recycling. This power supply caught my attention because of the output voltage of 19 volts, which comes very close to a traditional 12 volt solar panel in the sun. Using this power supply only requires a couple of connectors to make it work with my power boxes. This power supply has a 7.4 millimeter male plug. I'm going to use this 7.4 by 5.5 millimeter adapter to convert to the size of 5.5 by 2.5 millimeters. Lastly, I'll use a 5.5 by 2.5 millimeter DC coax female adapter to go to an SAE type plug. All of my DIY power boxes use SAE plugs and connectors as this is a very popular connection for lots of DC devices including some 12 volt solar panels. Just to note here, this box uses a programmable DC voltage regulator to step up power to the 7S battery. My other power box uses a step up MPPT charge controller. In both boxes, the BMS regulates charging and balancing. On the new power supply, 3.2 amps of power set to the current voltage yields close to 90 watts of output power. This draws nearly 114 watts on the AC side. Alright guys, that's about it. It's pretty much that simple. A bigger power supply yields more power. Chances are you may be able to find an old unused power supply, but if not, they are relatively inexpensive to pick up used or new online. Often you can find them for free. I'll leave links below in the description of this video for the parts mentioned above, as well as for my DIY portable power boxes. Nothing beats charging by solar, but sometimes you just need to plug into AC. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.